Hey, hey, what's up, LifeCast family? It's Lennon here. I'm coming to talk movement with some of the very best in the business, my former employers and great friends. We're going over to Level 3 Fitness, Denver, Colorado. Very excited. simple you know as we said the body is one and as it's moving um, there are local areas of, of movement and we call those joints so joints are the space that you know where two bones meet or sometimes three and they where motion occurs so like in the spine if I have been sitting all day and my thoracic spine up here in the trunk is really sticky and not moving and tight because I've been down here all day and I go to reach up to put something away and I go to move it's gonna not move here, and I might have to really move fast through the neck and a lot through the shoulder, and there, there's my rotator cuff pain or pinch that doesn't feel good. I would call the hypomobility, the lack of movement in the trunk, a big problem to the neighbor right above, gonna have to hyper move to make up for that lack of movement underneath it. So that's just a really simple strategy that we call above and below here. You know, um, if you have a low back pain, probably something that really you know we're trying to look at maybe in the hips or the thoracic spine above and below who's not moving in this scenario because the thing that is moving a lot is going to end up being most likely the guy that says i'm hurt i don't like you right so um another way to say that is victim and criminal you know, we've got this uh criminal thoracic spine right and this you know you go to reach in the back seat and the shoulder tears or hurts or pinches and it's like ow my shoulder and somebody please help me with my shoulder and it's like well the shoulder is just the victim here right can everybody see that that the the trunk that didn't let my arm go back is right there if my trunk was up my shoulder goes back really far and it's awesome right and in every plane or three dimensions again where if i'm going up and the trunk doesn't go up ow versus up yay you know, right. like, there's, your, there's your tennis elbow, your shoulder pinches, your, I mean, it's hypomobility, lack of movement, really big problem. Got, you know, this distance moving into the room here, distance moving that way into the room, and the space that's going up this way. So that three-dimensionality of the room that I'm in, or the environment when we're out there on the mountain, skiing, hiking, basketball court, racquetball court, tennis, like in your kitchen, think about it. You've got a length, a width, and a height to it. Okay. And as I said before, we've got three-dimensional structures here, a length, a width, and a height to it. We can grab this arm, right? It's not on a piece of paper. Mm -hmm. So it really behooves us to make sure that we have an exercise program, a rehab program, a life program, a mobility program to you know, get our bodies prepared to deal with the environment that we're going to live in. Okay.